Assalamu alaikum dear brothers and sisters our today's video is on moss builders work by day not in the night and then Gibson says so they fix the Qibla direction by the sun not by the constellations of the night sky it was customary with the seafarers to fix the direction by the stars because they had to move in the sea in both night and day so they fix their course by the sun during the day and by the constellations during the night. On the other hand, builders had to work in daylight as there was no lighting system in the ancient times. Builders could not work by night before the invention of the electric light. They fixed the Kibla direction by the sun and the deviations occurred as the sun deviates up to 23.5 degrees towards the north and the south from the equator with the change of the seasons. The cable stands on the equator, so deviations up to 23.5 degrees may occur in fixing its direction. Builders were not so expert about the night sky as the navigators were. Most builders were ordinary people, most of whom were illiterate. Even today, the builders of Asia and Africa don't know anything about the constellations of the night sky. So it is wrong to say that the moss faces were fixed by the stars. Stars are not seen in the daylight. Why should anybody bother about the stars of the night sky when the sun is shining before him? People in the ancient times fixed directions not by the degrees, but by the broad division of east, west, south, and north. People of India fixed the faces of their mosques towards the west as Mecca was to the west of them. Similarly, the people of Ethiopia faced their mass towards the east. They did not calculate how many degrees they deviated towards the south or toward the, towards the north. They never thought of any Dan Gibson, a typical non-Muslim, standing with a compass in his hand to find fault with their Qibla direction. No, they never thought of this unnatural calamity. We don't know why Dan Gibson is so interested in Petra. He is not a Muslim and Qibla is nothing to him. Both Petra and Mecca are of the same value for him, yet he is trying to falsify Mecca and solidify Petra. We don't know why. A mosque of London has got to face many cities between London and Mecca. Will anybody say that the mosque faces towards those cities? No. A very recent discovery of an ancient mosque of the 7th century in Israel clearly shows its Qibla towards Mecca. It proves Mecca as the original city of Qibla. Dan Gibson is wrong to favor Petra. We are sorry we cannot satiate his desire as Allah has fixed our Qibla towards Mecca. People are requested to see the verses from 142 to 145 of Surah Al-Baqarah. Dear viewers, if you find the video good, please click the like button. Share the video with your friends. And please subscribe the channel. Thank you for watching the video. Allah Hafiz.